Hi everyone, this is Aaron for Zolo Tech, and we're going to unbox the new iPad. For a quick comparison, here we have the iPad 2 box on the left, and the only way to really differentiate between the two is the image that's on the front of the iPad on the box. The box itself actually doesn't even say iPad or the new iPad or iPad 2, any of that. Uh, they're pretty similar as far as the boxes go. The one with iCloud on it is the new iPad. See, the boxes are exactly the same for the most part. And uh, interesting that they called it iPad. Nobody really picked up on that, I guess, uh, before. So that's the iPad 2 box. Very similar. Basic dimensions are the exact same. And they just repackaged it, uh, added iCloud, and changed some serial numbers on the back. This is the iPad uh, 32 gig Retina display. Let's go ahead and open it up. There we go. And this is the new iPad. So I decided to get just the Wi-Fi, not the 3G LTE version. Uh, I really don't need it. I have enough uh, areas where I'm on Wi-Fi all the time, and uh, that's pretty much it. So let's go ahead and see if this will open here, just by its weight. There we go. So there is the new iPad. Really doesn't look any different than before. New iPad here documentation, dock connector or sync connector, and one wall adapter, or AC to USB. That's it. So let me go ahead and put this back. And uh, there's probably Apple stickers in here, actually. Let's take a look anyway. So we have iPad, some Apple stickers, and that's it. So what you would expect nowadays from uh, Apple here. There we go. So here is the new iPad. Uh, let me go ahead and take the plastic off of it. There we are. Looks just like the old iPad, uh, only this one's black. My previous iPad, which I actually have here, I have the smart cover on it, is white. So I did that purposely so we could compare them. Uh, white iPad 2, new Retina Display iPad 3, or new iPad this is slightly taller. The new iPad uh, has a larger battery in it, better camera. You can Let's see at the back here. So this one has a Zag cover on it. This one has a little bit bigger lens, but overall basically the same. Interested to see the display. Let's see if we can rotate this one back. Wait for it to boot up. Now I had a black iPod, uh, iPad 1. And I like the black display, but I thought I'd get a white iPad 2. And now we're back to the black one. So uh, the screen does look really nice. Let's see if we can go through this first setup here. Let's see English, United States, location services. Now it does have a quad core graphics processor to handle all of those pixels. But other than that, not a whole lot of difference, I don't think the A5X processor. So I'm going to go ahead and put in my Wi-Fi password, get this set up, and we'll do some comparisons of the retina displays and things like that later. I uh, just wanted to do a quick unboxing. Basically feels the same. It is actually a little bit heavier, uh, but overall pretty much the same. And uh, I look, I've been looking forward to it for a while, so I'm going to go use it for a little while. If you have any questions, comments, anything you want to see as far as comparisons, please go ahead and comment below. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. This is Aaron. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.